I know what you want, son. Still keeping your seeing eye on me, Gabriel. I'm flattered. Well, I could offer something about how a shepherd leads even the most wayward of his flock, but it might sound disingenuous. I've been seeing a lot of unusual soul traffic lately. He might consider giving me an extension. Could do your sight some good these days. Still trying to buy your way into heaven. What about the minions I've sent back? That alone should guarantee my entry. You have no guarantees, John. The next time you find yourself in hell, you should pick yourself out a nice spot. <laughs> you should see it for yourself, Gabriel. You would fit in perfectly. I belong somewhere else. I deserve it. How many times have I told you? That's not the way this works. Things like this aren't just given away. Haven't I served him enough? What does he want from me, Gabriel? Only the usual self-sacrifice. Believe. I believe for Christ's no. sake. No, you know. And there's a difference. You've seen. I didn't ask to see. I was born with this curse. A gift, John. One that you've squandered I on selfish I demons endeavors. out of little girls. Who was that for? Everything you've ever done, you've only ever done for yourself. To earn your way back into his Impossible good Impossible rules. Endless regulations on who goes up and who goes down and why. You don't even understand us, Gabriel. You're the one that should be going to hell. You half-breed. Is that what you think, John? We are here for a reason, for people like you who think they can do whatever they like and not suffer any of the consequences. The balance is put into turmoil every day because of people like you. And it is my job to remind you of it. For your job? We all know what you really are, Gabriel. A filthy half-breed picked to do the ugly work. All of this? Yeah, I deserve it more than you. If you really believed that, John, you wouldn't be sitting here. Why me, Gabriel? It's personal, isn't it? What, I didn't go to church enough? I didn't pray enough. Why? Why? You are going to die young. Because you've smoked 30 cigarettes a day since you were 15. And you're going to go to hell because of the life you took. You're fucked. 